This field is in motion. They're off and pacing in the Hoosier Cup and firing from the outside. Day in life for Tony Morgan, right to the front end. Sealed and delivered. Comes away pacing in the second spot with Dragon again in third. Entry mate Workplace dropping in the fourth spot. Then it's Color Stripe moving from the far outside in fifth with Dex Appeal in between horses sixth. At the rail, Matt Namara's band comes away pacing in the seventh spot. Race favorite Art Escape on the outside is eighth and Invader Hall is the trainer. They go a quick first quarter here in 26 and two fifth seconds. Straightening away up the back stretch and day in a life leads it for tony morgan by two sealed and delivered along the inside right there in the second spot is followed at the rail in third by dragon again workplace is right there fourth is dragon again now ron pierce hustling him towards the front end up the back stretch and dragon again will be on the front end for the remainder of this mile on top a length and a half he'll be fighting off the closers as day in a life sits in the two hole that's sealed and delivered racing in third workplace advancing at the rail in the fourth spot from the outside it's been a rough journey for color strike in fifth, advancing along the inside in the sixth spot comes Matt Namara's band. Then it's a length back on the outside. Dex Appeal racing in seventh, followed up by Art Escape, who's got a lot of ground to make up as they head to the three quarters. Half mile, a quick 55 and two. Dragon again on the front end, meeting the pressure now from Sealed and Delivered. A strong bid from him and Chris Ryder. Day in a life at the inside is back in third. Along the rail, Workplace is fourth. And now circling five wide off the turn comes Art Escape, but he still has a tremendous amount of ground to make up. Off three quarters in 124 flat. And it's Dragon again, who leads him home here by a length and a half. Day in a life, looking for a clear shot at the leader in second. Two lengths back. Sealed and delivered is third. It's Dragon again by three. On the outside, Day in a Life is second. Dragon again by a length and a half. Day in a Life and Art Escape closing. Dragon again will win it. Dragon again wins the Hoosier Cup in 151 and three. Day in a Life was second. On the outside, Art Escape battling in a photo with Invader Hall for third. And now into the winner's circle. Here's the winner of the final of the Hoosier Cup. Number one, Dragon Again. Owned by C. Ed Mullinax of Amherst, Ohio. Trained by Kelly O'Donnell. And driven to victory by Ron Pierce. His first drive of the season here at Hoosier Park. And it's a big one as he wins the richest harness race of the year here. The $450,000 final of the Hoosier Cup. With a bold move to the front before the half. Dragon Again was never threatened from there. As the other favorites are escape. And day of life with just too much ground to make up. Art Escape coming from far back couldn't get there as Dragon again holds off all the closers. The three-year-old Brown Colt by Dragon's Lair out of Ever and Again with the fifth win and 11 starts this season. Nearly doubles his season's earnings. And this win pushes him over the $650,000 mark in lifetime earnings. Trophy presentations being made by Jeff Smith, the president of Hoosier Park, and Rick Moore, the vice president and general manager of Hoosier Park. Congratulations to the connections, C. Ed Mullinax, Kelly O'Donnell, and winning driver Ron Pierce for combining with the impressive victory here in the second annual Hoosier Cup.